Kamusta mga chong? Magandang araw ulit mga Kiss Banana for another unboxing of today's figure. Uh, ngayon, na-unbox natin si Bishop. Kilala nyo siya. Uh, siguro sa mga comic book fans, alam mo Filipino or at least partly Filipino si Bishop. Pero Lucas Bishop came from the future. Um, sa mga 90s kids dyan, alam nyo na naging part siya ng cartoons, especially on the Days of Future Past. Um, episodes and he played a major role in that particular segment of the 90s animated series. I think he was also part of the movie Days of Future Past pero hindi ganun ka significant yung kanyang um, role in that movie but still he is well known and is uh, very well known as an associate or affiliate ng X-Men and he's one of the characters as well na nagmamatch dun sa color scheme ng um, X-Men guys. So, blue, yellow, and typical red. But yeah, uh, he is part of the Sauron Build-A-Figure wave ng Marvel Legends. So, ito yung artwork niya on the side of the box and at the back figure. So, this wave contains Omega Red, X-Men in training, Deadpool uniform, Deadpool, and Wolverine, Lady Deadpool, and Bishop. So, si Sora na bilhin natin as is or uh, as a complete um, action figure. But as far as Bishop's concerned, we only bought the figure himself without the bath or build a figure. But yeah, uh, he will look great along with our X Men uh, display and the third portion of our Mac display cabinet, Mac glass display cabinet. So without further ado, let's open him up. So I think, nung nagkaroon ng um, comics si Bishop, marami yung um, uh, Filipino siya. Kaya, alam naman tayo, if ever there's particular character with uh, Filipino blood, uh, regardless if it's an artist, so represent and feel proud. So here he is outside of the box in, in the clamshell. Uh, wala siyang accessories, wala siyang alternate head, wala siyang alternate hand, naroon na siyang blaster, and the figure itself. So this is not the first appearance of uh, Bishop as far as um, action figures are concerned or the X-Men line is concerned. He had, he had a figure in uh, the Apocalypse wave of the Toy Biz Marvel Legends. So, meron pa silang uh, in license is with Toy Biz and not with Hasbro. Yeah, I think this is the more comic after it. I still, I also have that one um, which is, I think, is still in clamshell. Pero, since yung mga recent releases ng Hasbro Marvel Legends are more comic book after it, than their counterparts um, from their Toy Biz era. I think I will keep this and perhaps sell those old ones because they go for a lot now. Um, before I bought yung mga ganong action figures na Toy Biz around 300, 350 pesos or 400 pesos in buong wave. Um, meron dalawang variants dun. Isang long hair bishop and yung bald head na bishop. So here is the character and the action figure himself in his glory. Same usual swivel on the upper thighs, um, double G, uh, double knee joints, uh, knee. Um, the butterfly yung shoulder articulation, niya, so it just goes up to here on both sides. Um, double jointed um, elbows, uh, swivel on the hands, uh, parehong. Uh, form is to hold the blaster and you can place the blaster at his holster at the back like so and then you can just display him on it to pick up 
I think he also has telekinetic abilities um, in the show, but I'm not particularly sure. I haven't done uh, that much research um, prior to opening him up. But yeah, I'll display him and it probably looked good along with Cable and the rest of the gang um, from X-Men. There's a future pass because the color scheme niya works well with the others. And he is pretty bulky. For a figure around six inches or so. So uh, much like with the other figures, I think yung head nya would be better if it looking up. But as far as uh, making them stand, kasi medyo stiff yung uh, mga joints nya and articulation. So definitely, it will be uh, sort of a struggle to pose him the right way or the way that I want him to look in the display stand but if he doesn't um, stand I'll just use perhaps a uh, tack or um, if he looks good this way then I'll just pose him along with the rest of the X-Men uh, X-Men group <laughs> along with the X-Men group this way but yeah so I think that's it for Bishop Lucas Bishop, Filipino hero. Napakalakas at napakahusay. <laughs> Yan. So, unti-unti na nabubuo yung ating X-Men collection or X-Men display. And hopefully, they make more uh, comic, book, uh, comic book accurate figures as well as um, 90s animated series, uh, villains. Marami pang hindi nagagawa or na issue Hopefully, sooner or later, they'll do but for now, we'll just make do of what we have. But yeah, so guys, thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, share. Uh, another short video for you. Subscribe and hit the notification bell. So as always, stay safe. Pinoy Toy Collector. Monkeys Banana. Hashtag. Good shit lang. As always, take care. Peace out.